So, 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 Tanya, uh, you, uh, the, the, the water, the, the water, the water here, like, it's got, it's got a pressure valve, it's like... Fucking rainfall shower shit, man. Yeah, it's uh, got, like, the multiple... I never want to leave this shower in I'm my I'm just gonna life. hang out here for an hour. Right. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to no, I told, I told Optical I would take, or I told, I told Jack I would take a quick shower so i'll keep it to a relative bit of um so, I so you get shower and you step in the, the the towels are embroidered with 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 uh with mj um nice. and uh and like this this bathroom is gorgeous you could you could play oh, yeah. you could play fucking baseball in this bathroom right like so much room for activities just so much room right um and, uh, and after a minute, you know, you, you take a shower and like, oh, it's so good. And the, the stuff just like washes away and there's not a single mark. It's not even like blue, like my skin's not blue right now. Okay, It was cool. actually teal. I was, well, teal. Yeah. I, was, I was waiting for, I was waiting for like to dye my skin and be like in your blue for like the next month. Have yeah, a no, nice day. It's, <laughs> it's completely, you are, you are 100% mark off every last ounce of damage on your sheet. Levi. Holy God. Do I get yeah, willpower back? Mark off every last ounce of damage on your sheet. Woo! Do you, you get, get a, point, do you a get willpower? point of willpower back for a good seven. night's rest. Okay. Do I get a point of willpower back? For a good night's rest. Yes, you do. Oh, sweet. Nice. Awesome. That All right. Awesome. So, uh, so you will, uh... I don't have any of my own clothes... I just realized this. I actually only have like Judas's, uh, Judas's clothes that I have. I guess if that's what I have, I'll put that on. Yeah, it's not yeah like Judas doesn't have spare. there are no there are no spare clothes here for you. But there's you know, Judas's clothes are a little baggy on you. But you know, is there work. a bathrobe? Yeah, there's a bathrobe. Fuck yeah, plushy it's got, bathrobe. It's, got, Let's yeah. Go. it's plushy. Oh, with like, it's, oh, it's got it's duckies on it. Fucking slippers. It's like a white bathrobe with like duck print. Right, and you've got like the the fluffy duck slippers to match oh, that's it. Fantastic. Right, you come out with like a towel on your head and the fluffy right, question, duck then. What is Levi dressed in? <laughs> Say what? What is Levi dressed in? What is Levi dressed in? Uh, yeah. what, what did you show up in? I, I showed up in whatever clothes I managed to steal off the John. A suit of armor. Well, that's what you're wearing. And right a suit now, of right? armor. You showed up in a suit. You of don't armor. have the suit of armor anymore. Oh, okay. Oh. But you do have the clothes you stole off the uh, off the drunk guy. Yeah, but what did they put me in while I was in bed? Whatever you were wearing. Really? They didn't. So they only give her nice clothes because she stole from Judas. Okay, I got it. <laughs> oh no, no, I just managed to grab I... a bathrobe that was in the bath. Uh, you're, you're, bath. You aren't. You aren't Mistress Louder, right? That's yeah. true. I'm not. Gotta get them connections, man. Gotta, gotta <laughs> network, I am connect, son. I am, I am networked apparently with all of the nerds in this city. You you do actually so like apparently we could just get it anywhere. Nerd! Nerd! So uh so um, so so you know you can step out like that. Yeah, once I'm done with my shower and I'm like pretty much good to go, I uh, head back to the room and what's you know hey sorry about that. I just how long have, how long have I go got back to, to uh, the room where Jack is in. This is before you woke up, man. Oh, yeah, before I woke up. Yeah. Never mind. Um, yeah, and uh, this isn't like an hour. I probably got like what half hour. You probably got a half hour. And uh, and so you've got a uh, so you step out, uh, Jack. Before Tanya gets out of the shower, uh, you do have a little bit of time there with this guy who's completely bandaged up. Oh no, I'm 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 way preoccupied with my book. Right? All right. <laughs> so so if it, so if he's like, yeah, no, I'm, you just make I, I, like, really? literally it's like stonewalling everything. Yeah, like no, 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 no all right. Like I am so intent in my book right I got, now. I, I want to play the game. I just, I just lost the game, Matt. You're an asshole. Hey, you're welcome. I God win. damn it, okay. Matt! <laughs> you fucking dick. <laughs> so, no, no, so, so, Tanya, you'll, you'll, you'll step out of the shower. Uh, Matt yeah. will shut up, and you'll step out of the shower, and, uh, and, and, and just poke your head into the room with Jack. You got about a half hour before breakfast. Yeah. Um. So, no, you wanted to talk. Sorry, I had to just take. I had to wash that goop off. Uh. What's up? I'm what did you? What happened? What did you do I'm after we we so last in, night, man? I'm so intent on my book right now. Like I'm okay, looking so you're... at my book. Like poke him in the head. 
You uh, wanted uh, to talk. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was just like, you quickly. came to my room. <laughs> like I will. Quit. <laughs> I the book. Poke, like. poke, poke. <laughs> Yeah, no. Uh, like, as soon as, as no, soon are you really? Even... Are you like really actually like stonewalling me? Because I will. Like that's the last. No, 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 no. Like it's not that I not that okay. I meant to. It's that I'm just so enthralled in the book, right? And, right, right at that moment, like, and it, like, if you do come up and you... touch me, like I'll quickly sh- shut the book and like throw it in my back. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'll like, actually like no. if you if you're actually like in the, and your head is there, I'll like yeah. poke poke. Yeah. Hey, it's... buddy. What? What? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Sorry about that. I had to. Uh, oh no! You're fine. You're fine. Off. It's okay. Um, yeah. I'm not curious about the book now because I'm gonna figure it out later. Now's not. The <laughs> I am it's like, okay. I, but it's uh, okay. like so that book I... is staying hidden. <laughs> it's just there. <laughs> the okay, book okay. is my book, and <laughs> I'll get it eventually. I'll get my questions answered with a whole bunch of blank pages, and then I'll have. <laughs> um, but no, what? Is, uh, what? How? How are you? Are you? You're, I'm, I'm assuming you're doing okay. Have you? Yeah, no, I'm good. I'm good. Cassie, um, how are you doing? Like. What happened last saw you? Well, like I said, so me, me <laughs> sirens don't mix at all. Yeah. So as soon yeah, I f- as... Um, I knew there were sirens coming, though. Yeah, I kind of called them, and then I realized that there was a reason that Axel and Cassie ran out of the hospital. Oh, yeah. no, Levi saved no, us this there time. was... There was... Levi saved us. There was <laughs> other sirens than the... than the ambulance... And that's why I booked ambulance. Were other sirens? I didn't see anything. I was I was down for the count for that whole damn fight, man. Ambulances cool. I'm somewhat all right with. As soon as I hear other sirens, I'm out. Yeah, well, in this case, I guess we weren't supposed to be good with the ambulance. Just a uh, yeah, yeah, hospital bad. Yeah, hospital. yeah, I did it. You know, I wasn't thinking at the time because we were all getting the shit kicked out of us. Rule fifty two: If Axel runs, you run. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Leave you guys carried him. That was pretty funny. Write that down. Yes. <laughs> Write it down. Put it in your book. <laughs> uh, no. Um, you want to go grab some breakfast? Yes. I am God, fucking I'm starving, starving, bro. How about you? Oh, uh, you have no idea. I've had coffee All right. for like the past three days. Okay. <laughs> so you guys will head over to the breakfast table, and I believe yeah. Levi is about to get back from AFK, right? Unmute your shit. No, he's talking. I'm back. I'm back. I gotta uh, stop talking to you guys. Sorry. I got interrupted by housemates. And <laughs> That's good. I got ambushed in my Tell room. Tell them, shut up, I'm on TV. Like, <laughs> shut up. I am on shut TV. Up, TV. Oh, real life. Shut up, I'm on computer. Look, you you know what? I always get told real life is more important, right? So I was trying to. <laughs> People hitting your mailbox. Listen, more important. Yeah, exactly. Listen. This, this, All right. this was All right, me so bringing my I'm mailbox. kind of a big thing, deal right? on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have actually said that. And All right, then you bunch of Levi, butts. you are shuffling out to breakfast, right? Yeah, I'm shuffling out to breakfast. I got uh, the uh, cake Tanya in one hand. and that this rat, this is my canary. I'm watching for when he dies. He's right. got a rat in a cage as he goes to breakfast. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's a song, isn't it? That's a song reference. I okay. got it. Yeah. I understood that reference. Despite all his rage. So yeah. yeah so yeah, he's got a rat in a cage. Yeah. It's that's fitting. Right. Um. And uh, oh, so, so damn, Levi was shuffling. Right. It is fitting because, despite all my rate, oh my gosh, wow. That's okay, deep. so it's deep. I think so deep. I think, I think I just like went off. You're off camera. Oh, Put yourself okay. middle. Put yourself middle, and you're fine. Boom, boom. All right, so uh, you'll sit down at the breakfast table, uh, and actually at that point, uh, Jarvis will also sit down. Uh, and he, it's it's not he doesn't usually eat with the group. Right? Yeah, but, uh, only but, yeah he's totally eating with the group. Oh, this is awesome. The elder is, you know, someone that he would actually respect enough to can not. Can I sit next to, where is Jarvis? Can I sit next to him? Yes, you can sit next him to him. Him and I, I Jarvis, like, Jarvis I like will sit down. Jarvis. Jarvis will sit down next to you, actually. He'll wait until everybody is seated, and he will come up, and he will personally hand everybody their plate of food. I'm going to uh, put the rat cage right on the table. I'm okay with this. It ain't dirty rat. It's a lab rat. It's it's a lab rat. rat. Yeah, Jar- Jarvis, will, uh, Jarvis will pointedly ignore the rat. And... Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna feed it little, little bits of breakfast. Little bits of bacon and ham. And oh, he will he will wow. say, uh, in light of recent events, I it eats what I eat it, now because it's my lab rat. In in light of recent events, <laughs> I thought it wise to uh, to discuss with the direction things shall now head with those of you it is relevant to. 
Yeah, your people put strange shit that they don't understand into my body. No, I don't think that's okay, but you're walking again. Um, I think we're talking about the fact that Jeremiah is unfortunately no longer with us, to the best of my knowledge. And Master Judas Jeremiah is really hurt. Uh, and hang on, hang on, you, you interrupted him, Tanya. What did you say? Master, Ju Master Jeremiah is dead. That is very and, unfortunate. Um, that that yeah. man knew how to write a paycheck. He has <laughs> left. He has left a will. I don't know a lot about him. Okay. Uh... He has left a will, and uh, I am deciding how it is best interpreted. Isn't it usually just in like black and white? <sighs> no. Hardly. Levi. Wills never are. You guys are talking about a will? Do you want me to step out? Hardly. Okay. Mr. French, you are actually mentioned. What? Um. Uh, there is an address, and he will slide a card across the table to you. He says, "Surprise, Jack! You owe him." <laughs> <laughs> right, he slides. He slides a card across the table to uh to Jack. He says, "Um, uh, the will seem to be mildly aware that you were going to arrive." Uh, he wrote this will several weeks before his demise. I don't understand why, but, uh, nonetheless, uh, Miss Louder. And he will slide an envelope over to you. Uh, this was explicitly listed for you. Uh, I have already contacted, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Omega. They are fine. There was oh, thank God. Like, I'm actually going to say that out loud. Like, <laughs> okay, good. He says, uh, there was you. a lot of paperwork and then something about a barbecue with the mayor. Uh, He's at a goddamn barbecue? Are you sure it wasn't a casserole with the mayor? <laughs> he says, uh... Just, that's concerning if it's a barbecue and not a casserole. <laughs> <laughs> he says, uh... They have been contacted with theirs, and then the remainder of the things that were not designated were left to my discretion to uh, to give out. And given... Wait, out of character, I missed it. Did he give an envelope to Levi? No. I did no, not me. think so, but... He gave one to Tanya, I, 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 gave one I, I feel that it would one be... One to Tanya, good. one to Jack. I'm just double-checking I didn't miss something. I didn't... As, I mean, much as, to, as much as I would like to open eyes, this envelope, but... I feel that it would be in poor taste at this moment in time, and therefore I'm going to say this for one. How much did I get? He, he opens up. overwhelming up. amounts of curiosity. He pulls yeah. another envelope, he says, and this has been left to my discretion. Uh, and I feel, after having observed uh, the lot of you for some time now, that it is best left in the hands of someone with a mind that will be able to unravel its mysteries. And he will hand the last envelope to Tanya. Okay. She is going to college, after all. Uh. <clears throat> he says, uh. I wish you well, but I have business to attend to. Uh, Tanya, if you are at all interested, I will leave your contact information with Master Judas. Absolutely. Absolutely. I probably will actually be back to check on him, if you don't mind. This is, <laughs> this is not at all. You are always welcome. Uh, I will then lead you to your, what I am certain is gnawing curiosities. Uh, I wish you luck. <laughs> Extremely. Uh, enjoy your uh, inheritance, and until next we meet, and he will stand up, and he will leave the room. And all everybody right. else will filter out. Thanks, Jarvis. It's just you guys. Bye, <laughs> Bye, Jarvis. Bye like, Jarvis. Thanks, asshole. Like, <laughs> I like Jarvis. I'm because uh, he treats I'm me well. <laughs> not going to tear into this thing. I'm going to finish my breakfast first because I haven't. Right. Yeah, well, okay. In like yeah. forever, so I'm like. Before okay. I take a bite. Before I take a bite, the rat takes a bite. Aww. Where would you get this cool rat, by the way? Jeeves here the... is my. My uh, medic buddy. My medical What's buddy. What's his name? He's Jeeves. Jeeves. Yeah, I think Aww, he's related I'm going to pass you a piece of bacon to give to Jeeves. There's a family resemblance. 
I'm just shaking my head. Um, the <laughs> second envelope, I'm going to open. Because he said that was for, like, all of us. Like, someone to decipher it, right? That was the envelope. That, that was, he gave it specifically to you to, to you to decipher. Because he had discretion with it, yeah. Because he had discretion. So this is oh, yours. Oh, okay. And yeah, I'll... You get, you get, like, the key to a P.O. box. What the hell? All right. That's actually several keys to several P.O. boxes. And is it, there's no numbers? Are there numbers on the actual? Yeah, like, okay. there, 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 there's, a, there's a card there that shows you, like, where you would go. Where I actually go to get these P.O. boxes and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Got some, I got some keys to some P.O. boxes here. We'll have to check this out later. That's cool. I look at the address. Does anyone ring a yeah, bell? Do you, do you guys know what, whereabouts this is? It's in town I mean? somewhere. I'm kind of familiar with the city after ja all, so. Jack knows where that is. It's not in the best section of town. Okay. Um, I know where that's at. We can All righty. Then we go. Better go there during the day. The post yeah. office, right? No? Not uh, the post office. Never mind. I don't know. We assume that these are keys for safe deposit boxes, and I will assume that that's a, uh, a post okay, office. But as of right now, assumptions keep getting us into trouble. Like I said, no. I'm, I open. I'll open my envelope when I'm done with my. Yep. With my so, you, so you eat up. You open up, and uh, yours goes to a bank. There is an there is an account number. Oh, uh, that's mine. On the back. <laughs> okay, oh, that one. That one will be investigated at a later date when I am not with the rest of the party. Oh, that that was that was Jax. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Um, the other thing you get from the second envelope is a key. Oh, hmm. looks like a house key. Wait, me? No, no. You got you got a bank account number and a bank's business card. Okay. Tanya got the PO boxes. That was Jarvis's discretion, and then right. she also got a key, like a house key. Ooh, a house key? Well, what that's to the mansion. Anyways, I'm gonna. <laughs> it's the key to Judith's bedroom. Oh, that's adorable. That Jeremiah. But, uh... But not at all creepy. All right, that's. I'll have to figure. I'll have to figure that one out. So we'll let's enjoy our breakfast. Let's. How long? Okay, uh, so, how long you need, Levi? Until you're until you're good to go. Are you good to go? I don't know. Um, I needed to stay here at least three hours, and then I think they take the IV out. But I've got to keep taking it like once a day, according to them. Yep. Assuming okay. I don't want to stop. You guys keep playing. I'll be right back. Like, yeah. Steve's doing okay. Yeah, I'm doing fine. The, they they put some blue fucking cream on me, and now I'm like blue not cream. Swapped. That's great. Yeah, he now pokes, I'm not like pokes it to a... pokes the IV back. I've got yeah. like purple juice running in me. I'm on. Yeah, purple. no, I, I'm, I'm on I, purple I, I drink. I wish it was. Please, please leave my. Do, do you really think I'm not okay? Yeah, I was gonna say. Are you, you? Oh, okay. What's wrong with you, Jack? Sorry, I'm, my bad. No, I said, do you really think I'm not okay? Come on now. Are you? you know, not Jack okay? looks fine. Are, yeah, he's okay. You seem no, fine, right? Jack's always fine. <laughs> uh, have you ever seen Jack like actually take a beating? Uh, can't say it. it happens very often. He's good at like, no, that's okay though. The... Did you guys see that Shazam? That was pretty goddamn uh, awesome. Did you guys see Axel's power punch? I think I've never that's... seen him do that before. I think that's actually the reason that I hit the ceiling is I was so amazed. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Axel's power punch? Come on, I know you all saw it. I don't know what you're talking about. Dude, you were there. You were I there, don't, right? I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I, I know you don't ever like. I know you don't like. Okay, shoot. dude. Really? Like seriously, <laughs> we're all we've all got superpowers of some sort. That's oh, no, like, I just start laughing. So I know. Sure this there. is not a superpower. This is a fucking curse. Because every time that I've gone all rage machine, dude, I get drunk. I feel very. Oh, that's nice. I wish I could get drunk. That'd be cool. Okay, actually. But, uh... At this point, like I actually, I'm a like you see me pull my book out and just start looking at it again. All right, <laughs> like, what is well, that? You know, for somebody who's not addicted to drugs, you sure are addicted to that book. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Yeah. What? 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 That's fine. You know. Uh... So, what? No, it's okay. He pulls it out to avoid the conversation. I talked about Tanya. I've, I've seen people like this. Oh, okay. okay. Well, he's avoiding conversation. Jack, Jack, no, you no, realize, what? like, this what? shit with the darkness is not over, right? Oh, I know. Yeah, okay. killing the Kenningtons didn't, didn't, they're killing, killing oh, whoa, Jeremiah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did nothing. We didn't, 
it's not like we meant to kill him. I know. I know we didn't mean to kill him, but okay. we definitely did. And because we fought of that, like these demon possessed dudes or anti demon possessed dudes earlier. Like we, there's this person, me apparently, a Jack and uh, Axel now named Faith, and she was having her apartment ransacked. She wasn't there. We don't know where she is, actually. And, hmm. so, like, we watched these guys jump out of a freaking window. Seven stories up. Straight to the ground. Walk away fall like it's nothing. So, I kind of figured, you know, Jeremiah could handle probably, you know, a guy swinging a sword at him. It was kind of freaking scary. Yeah, I guess. And I'm not about to go all rage machine on these guys, because every time I do something like that, it ends up really bad. I mean, car, guys... look, look at my legs! There we go! Bad stuff, yeah! Have I actually seen Levi go Hulk mode? No. I have not. What do you mean by, what do you mean by, I'm actually like, what do you, what okay, do you mean by rage you know mode? How, you know how the Leaflings called me angry? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it turns out that's the scope of my superpower is. I get angry, and then I get smashy. Okay, I have a question. The Incredible Hulk totally exists in this universe, right? Like the comic book. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would. Uh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, like sorry. Uh, yes, it does. Okay, so I could be like. Because so, so, I would condescendingly like, look at you and be like, "Yes." So literally, like the yeah, like the Incredible Hulk. Okay. Like, so yes. Control yeah, we, we I, I'll be honest. Go, I haven't followed his comic book, so I don't know if he has a happy ending or not, or if he's just you know. Let's. Yeah. No. No. Got, no. No. We no. Got we, we got to, it's go. different, obviously. I'm sorry. Yeah, guys, we got we got places that we gotta go. Like, yeah, we always have places we need to go, Jack, and then we get into more trouble. So why don't we just like chill the fuck out this time? We have a nice <laughs> breakfast. I'm watching this rat to make sure he doesn't keel over and die on me. I uh. You okay? Also, I've got to wait what? like the... another two hours before I. Do you I want can to tell us actually... where we're going and why we're going there? Do you want to tell us something? Oh my gosh, she's gonna speak. <laughs> Give him a second. I've got a place to go. <laughs> if you want to come with me, you can. Does, 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 does Where? Name? Uh, this time I'm going to need more information. It's a building. <laughs> That's not enough information. You know, the last time you told me I would find out what was going on, I ended up skewering a dude in the lungs by accident. Did you find out what was going on? Not really, no. <laughs> Whose fault was that? And actually, you did find out, because I remember hearing Tanya tell you in the backseat of the cab, so you did find out. So I did Honestly, hold you that. No, that's there fair. That's fair. I've been yeah, on yeah, yeah. So say we actually, yeah. and hormone <laughs> and all this shit. I barely remember anything anymore. Well, maybe you should not do drugs. That's um, probably also part of my superpower. Yes, I forget all of the things. <laughs> I got a place to go. If you guys want to come with, you guys are more than welcome to come with. You got uh, room this in your... in time, I'm wait, sorry, wait, but... How, where's he going? More information... Well, oh, you're, you're good. I mean, like I said, it's you guys want to come with, you guys can. Okay, I got I got actually just one question. I'm not hiding anything. I'm just not going to tell you where it is. Like that that's means you're hiding something. That's but That's literally the deal. No, cuz you can come that's with the, me and see it, but there's no point in me on. telling you and then go and then going there and that's hang like on, in my on, mind in Jack's mind, that's just redundant. Like Jack, I got one question for you. I got an answer. Let's see if they if match. We, if we go to this place, Am I going to have to do anything that I'm going to regret later? Probably not. Totally, probably, definitely not. And I'll come with you. I think, no, you know I what? think... Out of character, Levi's loyal to a fault, and he can't, like, he, he has this thing against Jack for, you know, never, for withholding all this information, but at the same time, he's loyal enough to go, okay, fine, I'll fucking trust you again with a... <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. He keeps getting closer. <laughs> all right, all right. So, so Levi's gonna go with Jack. Uh, Tanya, you're gonna stay here, right? Um, you got you got room in your ride for a wheelchair, right? Yeah, I'm gonna stay here, and I'm just yeah, gonna. gonna I, I want to okay. keep an eye on uh, Judas. Right. Okay. Um, I wouldn't mind getting in touch with Axel and seeing what he's up to. Axel is uh, like Axel's got like he is, he is fine <laughs> and he is buried in police work right now. 
Stop okay. trying to get in contact with the guy. Like, who this all happened. <laughs> well, no, 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 I know that, but I've just. His, that's her character was told it. While I'm away. It, it's my no. job. It's my job to keep Axel off panel, not hers. No, uh, I know. So, it's so, great. so, it's so great. basically, I, uh, <laughs> you'll, you'll get in contact with him, and he won't want to talk for too long because he always tries to get off the phone with you. But basically, yeah. you'll be aware he's buried in work. He's got all the stuff. He's going through a tunnel. Click. <laughs> oh, oh, get back. I, I, it, click. <laughs> Um, okay, so exact thing. I'll handle Tanya, and then I'll handle you two, and then and then we can uh, then we can move to uh, to XP, I think, because we're mm -hmm. we're, we're, yeah, we're moving yeah, towards yeah. close here. So uh, so Tanya, um, I just want to are... I just want to keep an eye on Judas. He's yeah, in Jud rough like, shape. And... Judas is just. You might want to. I don't know what he's saying, Tanya, but I'm gonna Tanya. at least like pull the. Uh, no, I'm Tanya. Trust me, coaching. I Tanya, can't. and he, 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 he motions you with his fingers, the one thing he can move, right? Yeah. Tanya. Hey, buddy. Hey, you you got hurt there, little. You got hurt there, dude. Uh, fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm staying here. I'm staying here with you for a while. No. Uh, no, Shaka. Did Jarvis give you the envelope? The, 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 the did, what? Did Jarvis give you the envelope? The en, the en some, I really... Are you really not following that? <laughs> Are you dumb? <laughs> Maybe I am! You got beat with that? Is, no, uh, no, I'm did, amused by it. Continue no, being I, dumb. I, I'm understanding everything but the last word. The envelope. <laughs> The envelope. The envelope. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. And he'll actually go, yeah, with his fingers. Right? <laughs> I'm like, envelope? Sorry. What the hell? Like, I'm thinking, like, keys or, like, something. Yeah, I'm yeah. like, yeah, you know. I don't just, mean to be cruel. It's just, oh, yeah. it, it, Once I got something. Two, all, ducks. Key or what the keys, fuck? Keys. 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 Keys, yeah, keys. Keys to the uh, I yes. thought he said to take off the yes. box. Yes. You got it to you? Yes. Just go off your nose. Like right now? Now. Like like super right now? Like should I already be gone? Yes. <laughs> okay. I call. <laughs> <laughs> I call? That's what I got out of I'll, that. I'll call. <laughs> No, you, you won't come with me. No. A call. Ring, ring, ring. Oh, oh, call. Oh, oh. I'll call. Oh, man. What a guy's paralyzed for everything except his tongue. And his finger! His little leggy finger! <laughs> One finger wave. Hi. Oh, my God. All right. I guess I, I, I can go open the... Okay, so we're going to flip over to Jack real quick. Yeah. Jack. And Levi. Yeah, well, and Levi. You head, you, head, you head to the bank? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, you'll head in. You'll look at the walk I'm going to head in, and I'm going I'm to motion for Levi to kind of stand back a little bit while I talk to the teller. Yeah. And, uh... Yeah, Levi will just lean on his IV stand. <laughs> the, the, teller, the, teller will, uh, the teller will look up. Hmm? Yeah, mm -hmm. I was I was given this oh. information. Oh, uh... Can I see... Is that... Oh, it's Mr. Kennington's handwriting. Would you like access to this account, sir? Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, sure. I, I'm going. I'm going to require your name. Uh, Jack. Jack French. Here you go, Mr. French. Beep, 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 beep. He says, "She says a." Uh, ah, yes. This was the special order. Um. I'm going to need you to sign this before I allow you access to the account, sir, Mr. French. Okay, I'm going to scan over it before scan I start it. Scan uh, over Okay, so it Just says... The general gist of what's going on. The contents of this bank account belong to you so long as the only thing they are spent on is to repay your debts. Oh, okay. Do you want me to look over that the contract? Mojo, Mojo, the contract is voided should the money from this account be spent for any other purpose. If the contract okay. is voided, the money will go to Jarvis. Okay. 
man, Jarvis is smart. He knows how to get that money. That wily bastard. No. <laughs> I'll sign it. Yeah, you sign it. You sign it. You hand it back, right? Yeah. She says, uh, "Here you go." She'll sign. She'll 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 hand you. She'll slide you into the card. It's got like a passcode and a place, and you go like, and and you can go. You can check the the balance in the account. Yeah, it's obviously what I'm gonna do first. There is more money than you know what to do with in that account. <laughs> there is more money than you know how to shake a fucking stick at. Okay. Like there is a fuckload of money in that account. <laughs> That's yeah, pretty awesome. Generally, like my like Jack would look at me like, "Damn, damn!" Like <laughs> that's <sighs> okay. A stupidly illogically large amount of money. That's yes. a good way to put it. Yep, it's a good way to put it. It's um, Batman levels of money. Um, give me a willpower <laughs> check. That's a lot of money. <laughs> Are you gonna fifty turn grand Batman? will be enough to change your life irreversibly, right? This blow, this fucking fifty grand chump change. What am I? Nice. What am I doing here? Resolve plus composure. Oh, Levi, wanna, give, me, give me an empathy, empathy check. Like number or not? Levi gets an empathy check. Awesome. Which empathy? Don't, I don't remember if I have empathy. You probably don't. You're you. I, uh, I do actually have. Empathy, Damn, so. son, he's role playing. I have the motherfucking empathy, but uh, this isn't a fast talking situation, so I don't. Three get successes. Oh shit, that. son. Oh shit, you have like. Uh, Jack? Oh, no, I got two successes. I right. read this shit off Jack's body language, like, oh, what's up, yo? Like, whatever it is, Jack is pretty fucking pleased with whatever he saw in that account. So, what you're saying is we should come to the bank more often. Don't forget oh. all the times I put a roof over your head. I'm sorry, what? Nothing? <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm just gonna turn around, like, I'll, like I'm gonna turn around from the ATM with a little smirk on my face. Yeah. A little spring in my step. Yeah. <laughs> I'm putting the card in my wallet and sticking it in my. I'm clearly I'm actually, can't get my wallet. Card. This is the wallet that he has, so it's a front hip pocket wallet, yep. not a back pocket wallet. Right. I'm just gonna slide it in my wallet. And stick All it in my wallets card. are technically front hip pocket wallets. No, 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 the best no, way no. To keep from getting stolen from you. Yeah. Okay. Pickpocketed, or rather. Yeah. Uh, so, hey, uh, so Levi, thing. what do you do? Do you do anything? Uh, He's happy, but he doesn't tell me shit, so I don't expect to open up a conversation with him and find out, like, why he's happy. So, no, I'm not going to say All anything. Right. Like, I right. I'll accept the fact that he probably just received a large sum of money because it's a will. That's and, what you do in wills. Yeah, and you, you went to a bank. Money. Yeah, it's and like now he's happy. All right, so. You so, just uh, wait for the right person to die. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Got I got made. this. I got this. Um, Let me. I'm gonna send you. Go ahead and go ahead and go over what you're gonna say. Guys. Okay, so so we're gonna fade. We're gonna fade there on Levi and Jack. All right, uh, Tanya. If Judas tells me it is really important that I need to go and get these goddamn Judas, things, Judas then, actually seemed really insistent, like through the yeah, cast and everything. Go, yeah, then I'll go. If uh, they've already left, I'll go. Cause so you right. you go and uh, you go to the post office, right? You check out mm -hmm. the post office boxes. It and each one they're scattered. They're not like a like a string. Like they're yeah randomly like. Uh, it, and, and you, you pop one of them open, and you pull it, and you, there's a crucifix in it. Woo! And then you pop the yes! next one. That's a crucifix in it. And as you're popping the third, there's four, by the way. Okay? Hmm. It, as you're popping the third, you get the distinct feeling that somebody is watching you. Yeah! Uh... I need to not open that fourth one. Oh, but I really want. Mm. Which one of the crucifixes? There were there were four, there around. were there were four crucifixes, right? And yeah. you open three. Oh, okay. It's as you're opening the last one, you get the distinct feeling somebody's watching you, and like you were just like this was you needed it now. You're you're getting okay. the sense that like you somebody that these crucifixes are important. Yeah. Somebody's watching so I'm you. I'm gonna take I'm all of them then. Take um, I'm gonna look around and be like, what the hell? Like I'm gonna actually look, like try to really scan the room, and be like, who the fuck could possibly be Give watching? Give me intelligence plus investigation. Sorry. <laughs> Maybe I had a little Two too much. And one, so three. Well, damn shit, girl. Son. All right. <laughs> None of these people are watching you, but you got that feeling, the hair on the back of your neck. Somebody you can't see is watching you. 
Okay. Um, and I have all the crucifixes with me right now. Or are they, I just open a box, look, and then shut it back? Like, yeah. Did I pick up all the... Do you know that there are seven crucifixes? Or does Tanya not know that? He had, he only had four. Okay. But how many, well, how many keys did I have? Four. There are four, four. keys. Oh, okay, There's okay. four crucifixes. Uh, Kennington's collection, as you recall from the start of the adventure, was four crucifixes large, right? Out of a total potential of seven crucifixes. Okay. Oh, snaps. <laughs> the teller could have given... I'm sorry, I'm laughing. I'm, I'm laughing at Bam Kiss's joke there. <laughs> um, so, what do you do? Do you, do you um, yeah, look I'm at the last one real quick? All these, uh, all these crucifixes, and I'm going to get out of there while constantly looking around me. Okay, the last, the last crucifix comes with an envelope. Okay. And it has a note with your name on it. What the fuck? Oh, I gotta read this. Oh, what the fuck? All right, so you so you, you open the like you open, and it's it's like you look at the bottom like who wrote this? Kennington, Jeremiah Kennington, right? Yeah. He says, "Look, this is gonna be confusing, Tanya. Uh, I told Jarvis to give it to who he felt he was gonna give it to. He gave it to you. Right now, there is somebody you can't see reading this letter over your shoulder." Yeah. <laughs> He says, Creepy. don't worry. I'm, okay. Well, actually, I was going to, like, legitimately, if I read that sentence, my character does a 180. So yeah. they're no longer, like, reading. No, no. no he, says, he, says, he says, he says, <laughs> he says, these crucifixes are exceedingly important to somebody oops. that I think may have ended my life. Uh, oops. Okay. Uh, he says, these, these crucifixes are exceedingly important to somebody that I think may have ended my life. Uh... I am leaving it to you to determine who should know this story. But for the sake of my older brother, who will be inheriting the, the, the company and all of the estates, I'd rather this was not made public. Um, and you're like, what? What is it, right? What the fuck? He says, when my father died, I almost tanked the company. It went up in flames. We were in the hole quarter after quarter. It was awful. Uh, I was approached by a woman by the name of Hope. She started uh, dun, dun, dun. offering me a, a means to recover my business, investments to make, uh, and all she requested in exchange was that I stand under the light of the full moon every night. Uh, every every night the full moon was out. I knew it! I knew it was uh, the full moon, and all we had to do was close the curtains. <coughs> she says, oh, at first this was at first this wasn't a problem, but then the request got a little more complex. Eventually, she was asking me to collect these crucifixes. I don't know what she wants them for, but I started to feel sick, and then the murder started happening, and I don't think that I'm going to make it through another month. I'm, co I'm contacting the mayor tonight. I'm going to have him seek out uh, Axel. A lot of stuff is going to go down. And by the end of it, you're going to have these crucifixes. Please don't give these to Hope. I don't know why she wants them, but I know that something is wrong. And I have a really bad feeling that if she gets a hold of these, more people are going to have things go wrong. I wish I could explain how I was writing this. But honestly, I don't even know if I'd believe it. This is a crazy letter. Signed, Jeremiah Kennington. Oh, man. Oh, man. I gotta go. I gotta take these four crucifixes and I gotta go because I'm still, I'm assuming I'm still feeling like that uneasy, like someone's watching me. Yep. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> so yeah, we gotta, I gotta go and I gotta, sh I got some, I got an information thing. Um, and I got this one other key, right? And you said it looks like a house key. This isn't a safe deposit key. Right? The, oh, that, that, that house key. Yeah, okay. Um, that, yeah, that house, house has an address a... on it. Oh. Well, cool. Um, so, yeah, I will, uh, I will head back then as quickly as possible to where, to the, to the, okay. you know, we're, where Judas is. Okay, we're going to flip to, uh, we're going to flip to Jack and Levi. You guys Reverse. are going to, you guys are going to be going back to, uh, back to the house now, right? That's where he's going to be leaving you, Levi. But on his way there, he's going to stop at, like, a clothing shop. Jack is going to stop at a clothing shop. 
There's, gonna, there's not going to be a word. There's not going to be an explanation. He's going to walk over. He's going to lean in real close to the person behind the counter. He's going to say something. The guy's going to turn around and the nod. Like, the guy behind the counter is going to nod, right? Uh, and then he's going to go into the back room. And he will emerge with a suit. Hanger, like, in the plastic, right? And Jack will, uh... What you doing, Jack? Jack will take the... Jack will take the... the the hanger, right? And start walking towards the door. And you'll start following. And then before you know what happened, somehow, like, you're holding the suit. And Jack is walking ahead. (laughs) (laughs) Alright, I got a plus one suit. Jeeves, you know what the fuck is going on. (laughs) I think I think Jack just paid for something. <laughs> Squeak. I. Squeak. <laughs> um. So 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 we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up here. Uh, Tanya, you can yeah. can you tell us out of character? Like, are you gonna pass that story on to the others? Ah, uh, yes. Okay, so you guys will, by the end of this is over, like you'll 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 know. Yeah, and I personally think that each of us should carry one of the crucifixes as well. Each one of us should have one of the crucifixes on our person. And once we get, once I find Axel, I'll give him his. Or once you know, once Axel finally rejoins us, hopefully. If we, if we get a fifth one, because it's a set of seven. Yeah, it's a set, totally if there's a set of seven, we have four. Well, we have four right now, yeah, and so I figure here, just in case, you know, in case one of us goes down, then she's only got one of them, instead of if she if she ganks me, and now I've got, yeah, come on, come on, guys. Let's, right. okay. I'm thinking, oh, yeah. what if you give the fifth one to Cassie, and then we'll know that one's safe forever. Oh my <laughs> god, <yeah. laughs> we are right, giving so one to Cassie. She can X- make it into a castrol, and no one will ever know. Before we do XP, <laughs> alright, before we do XP, we need to, we need to do beats. For this yeah. session, let's, let's, let's let the audience in on this. Um, so here's how this works. All right, we get a. Uh, I I bring up the spreadsheet. Uh, he does. He games. brings it up. He I brings bring it, it up, up, and then you and he looks at it, and then he asks us about it. And that's yeah, how I know. We... That's how this. That's how this works. It's a very elusive and rare process. All yeah. right, so um, you're getting the inside scoop. Uh, and then. Boom. Okay, so uh, who did their, uh, their their? We're gonna start. Levi, what about your archetypes, your archetypical tropes? What'd you get? Uh, uh, let's see. Well, hang on. What are his archetypal? Uh, he he did you know loyal to a fault. I would say. Yeah, okay. Well, it didn't it didn't really cost him anything, but like he was willing to go. You know what? Yeah. 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 Jack. Fine. I'll put up with your still... annoying shit. Yeah. And I'll exactly. come with I'll you. Still... Fine. Be that way. But at like... the same time, he's holding a grudge over the whole lack of information thing. And now he's I'm holding a suit. Doing this, but I'm doing it under protest. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. And now you're holding a suit. Yeah. And now I'm. Yeah. And direct approach leaves. And I don't know if you used the direct approach with anything other than. Oh no, uh, you did. You totally asked me flat out, like, "Hey, what's going on?" And just <laughs> nope. I, I, no, I would say that it was a moment you. of dramatic importance, though. So no, it was. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So all right. So next, There's what was that. your third one? What's that? What was your third one? Uh, oh, well, I have the direct approach, holds grudge, and loyal to a fault. All right, all right. Okay. So, so grudge. We got the grudge. Okay. Um, what is your insecurity? My insecurity is an envy of success. An envy of. I think you nailed that one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like I, uh, I you and like Jarvis do not get along at all. No, it's it's true. That's you actually true. Right. Jarvis is kind of a dick. Putting the putting the the, the rat on the breakfast table, like. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that, that was, was a deliberate dick move at Jarvis. That was, that was, that was pretty. Fuck you and your stuck upness. Here's a rat on your breakfast table, motherfucker. <laughs> it's not even like it's a dirty. It's not like it's a swamp rat. It's a fucking lab rat. It's, it's a really rat, sweet. and Jarvis is a butler. There's a mortal <laughs> enmity there. <laughs> All right. So uh, mortal enmity. So, so what about what about your virtue? Doing the right thing at any cost. I don't think he did that today. I was actually going to... I never got the chance to do this. That's why I was hoping we got dropped off at a game shop. I was actually going to pay off a game shop clerk in order to be able to, like, set up a meeting between Gryffindor and that and the ambulance guy. I was I was totally going to do it. I was going to, like, shell out money for the, to bribe him and everything. <laughs> I just didn't get a chance to because we didn't... We weren't in the right area. Okay, yeah. so, so Tanya. But I don't get a beat for good intentions, unfortunately. <laughs> Tanya. 
You have three archetypical tropes. What are they, and did you ping them? All right, the first one is takes care of others. This is about putting other people first. Take of the wounded, caring about their feelings. I was mortally wounded, burning, like, my skin and shit, and I was still, like, concerned about getting Levi and Judas the fuck out of Dodge. Yep. And I gave it my all. Like, I gave really tried to give it my the all. Like, oh, she tried so hard. And you know what? We give beats for being the little engine that couldn't. I know, right? Oh my god, I tried so hard, and in the end, I just ended up drunk and passed out on the floor. When did this turn into we give beats? <laughs> we don't get to give beats. Alright, uh, so you got takes care of others. What else? Um, what was your next one? And, you know, that whole moment with Judas about how, like, if it's gonna be okay, and I'm I'm fucking hurt, and it's just, it'll be fine. Um, insatiably curious. Uh... I mean, I ripped open the envelope, but other than that, I didn't really have anything, like, super crazy to be curious You've about. Got, yeah, you have an act on like, it, but you've got plans for Jack's Notebook. Yeah! <laughs> I'm super curious about Jack's Notebook, and that's good at that. Oh, yes, it will be mine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right, not, this uh, not, not super curious. I can't, uh, risk tick, I can't risk pissing off Jack to get that book, and I will not <laughs> piss off not? Jack to get I that mean, book. Jack right. is not threatening, honestly. I mean, have you seen him? He runs. No, away it's from not a friendship. Giant. We have a friendship. That's a line. There's a line there. And if oh, I try to take his giant lines. Lines. that's a line. I was saying, did you notice, <laughs> Levi, that I only went to make sure she was okay? <laughs> We're friends. Hey. I'm really I'm curious about the book, but lines, I'm not going to risk ruining the book. Lines are kind of imaginary. <laughs> thing. Like, da, 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 like, there's a line here. There's lines you know that have been crossed all over the place. If you, you know get a you snoop on somebody, they nothing. can't find out about it later. All right? All right. <laughs> so, so you didn't get curiosity. You did get takes uh, no, care of others. And what a... was your last one? Uh, my last one is optimistic and hopeful, which in that point I was actually going to say, um, well, you know, I, I snagged Judas's I'd hand. So. And... Yeah was talking to him and being like, hey, don't freak out, don't freak out, just come down and lie down with me, everything's gonna be fine. Okay. Um, well, lie down with me. Come lie down um, with me. Come sit down. Lie down next to me. Uh, and Jack! Down. Um, indirect approach. That's right, flex. Again. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you indirect approach for a couple of things you did tonight, actually. Okay. So um, he's gonna get it more than once? Uh, you, you went, like, you went, uh, your, you, your, uh, your solutions to, like, making certain people were okay, right? Like, you tried oh, yeah, to yeah. stay in the shadows and not be in the big scene, and you were out of the spotlight the whole time, right? That was yeah. pretty brilliant, I gotta say. Like, you made brilliant. sure we were okay, and then you just disappeared, and we're like, where, did Jack <laughs> where the fuck go? did Jack go? Like, <laughs> he's Batman! <laughs> like, what happened? Fucking <laughs> uh, okay, sirens, so, Batman. So what was your, ne what's your next, Ghetto uh, Batman, archetype? Maybe. Um... Never the whole truth. Which means partial truth. So at some point, did you give a significant partial truth, but not the whole truth this session? Yes. When? But it wasn't really dramatically impactive. What, when was it? Going to the bank. <laughs> yeah, it's not particularly dramatically about I, right. I thought it was, it was Where are you going? It's a building. You didn't, didn't give it. Any, you didn't give any truth at all, but you gave Levi a suit. I don't know it what that. Was, no, I gave the truth. We went to a building. Yeah, we went to a building. Woohoo! <laughs> That's. <laughs> we went to a building. <laughs> all right, all right. So, so not, not, inco not, not. Uh, never the whole truth. What is the next one? Uh, bears the burden for I... others. Did you bear a burden for anybody today? Bought me no. a suit. You know what? I think you did. I think you did. I think your conversation with uh, the guy with two hair colors. Right? Oh, yeah. He he seemed to imply yeah. that if you turned out to not be a good guy, you would die. Yeah. Right? And and you took that on you. The conversation I had with the guy with two colors was weird. It wasn't even it was a dream. Exactly. That's fucking weird, man. I don't know. Oh, some dude with two colors. I don't dream. Y'all are nuts that. with your rabbits I and shit. Seriously, that. Levi's <laughs> fucking Levi's on crack with, with rabbits and dudes with two right. hair colors. And Jack I'm is sure. like, I don't know anything about a guy with two hair colors. Not I don't know about <laughs> you. are your rabbits, bro. I don't, I don't just I don't just dream about rabbits you're, anymore. Now you I got see rabbits rat. smelling grass. You're fucking nuts, all right? I don't rabbits. know what the fuck you're talking. A guy with two hair colors? What the? No, no. It's I think it's all rodents though, guys, because I've got a rat now too, and it's all so white. Okay. Um, you guys will have earned a supernatural beat for having Oh, solved. I did hit my virtue too. What's your what's your virtue? Very yeah. charitous. Yeah, no, no, you pinged it tonight. <gasps> you did, yeah. No, you pinged it. Um, yeah. you guys, okay, so then, uh, then. Oh wait, does that mean I get a willpower back? 
you yeah, on, so a, you on a virtue, all you refill all if, willpower. All yep. when you when you fill out your virtue, you get all willpower back and to be. Yes. Oh, I get my willpower back then for envy of success. So sweet. No, that's that's not your virtue. I get my vice your, though. That that yeah, that's your insecurity, also known so as I, vice. So I get it. Yep. I got it. I got that shit. I got um, it. Okay, Walk so uh, you guys solved the mystery of hope and Kennington. Sort of. Oh, we did. Well, we know that she was involved in him keeping the business, but we don't know why, and we don't know how oh, she question, managed to pull please. that off and all that. Well, we do know why, because the, the business was failing, and he, no, he did we that. don't know why she did it. Right, but you don't know, you don't know about like why Prudence helped Joe either. Who's Prudence? Prudence was that. Prudence was the yeah. was the. Woman I know who Prudence is. I'm asking that in character. Did you see the moose antlers? I don't think so. That, we're not playing right now. <laughs> I got a question real quick. What's up, Jack? Um, and by Jack, I mean optical. <laughs> would would my insecurity ping? Would it have pinged from last week? My ping is my, my insecurity is the unable to pay anyone back. Yeah, yeah, you'll never be able to pay people back. Faith, since I lost her phone, I have a question. And that would actually make it so that I couldn't pay her back her phone, like. Yeah, I know, like, that's, that's you know, you can buy another phone. You've got a phone. super bank account now. You can totally pay her back. No, but that's what I'm saying. Like, it would have pinged last week before I had that. Like, yeah, okay. yeah, no, totally. That just oh, clicked in point. my head. Okay, in the, in the future, you're supposed to get the beat when you play it. Well, yeah. And at the time, yeah. you didn't get the chance to play it. But in the future, yeah, that is the exact kind of moment. Like, oh, shit, I'm that. never going to be able to get her phone just like that one, right? Like, now, now that he can, now that he has the monetary means to pay everyone back, uh... Doesn't that destroy his insecurity? <laughs> no, because money doesn't repay some of the shit he owes. He owes some people like his life. Oh, yeah, I see. Well, Mike. that's that's like a billion dollars. Not many dollars Mike. Or whatever. But Mike, not many Mike. Mike. But Mike, Mike. Yeah. Um, Mike. I will never be able to pay back Mike. Like, that depends on if you have enough money to build a time machine. No, no. <laughs> Apparently, Jack can do it. I mean, Jack. I mean, Kennington. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hold on, guys. I need this really big yacht to pay back my debts. And the other Fine. thing is, like, if you ever think about it, like, if you ever go out, like, the other thing is you could say, like, if we ever go out to eat, like, I can't pay for every in, everybody else and myself. Like, I can't do that. Right, because that's not repaying pay debt. for everybody else, yeah. Yeah. Um, right. Yeah, okay, so so then uh, you guys will get the three freebie beats. You get the one supernatural for having solved the mystery of hope. Uh, you guys will get, uh, you, you guys will get a supernatural beat for having well. experienced the private medicine of the Kennington family. Which is Ooh. fucking freaky as fuck! Because holy Question. shit, they can just pump purple juice and your legs start working. Way. Um, the blue coloring of my stuff, is it similar to, like, the blue that would be swirling in his crap, or...? His stuff is purple. Oh, my his stuff, stuff is it's straight purple. Okay, I thought I'm, it was, like, a... I'm on purple like color, so, okay. purple. I'm on purple drink. By the way, Squeege, you did get the other part of that, that whisper that I sent you. Your mama! Which one... Uh, it was for both of them. No, your mama. Oh, okay. okay. Um, oh no, okay, no, I, I, I didn't see, I didn't see that you'd also got Tanya something. So Tanya, when you're, you're giving him this information, my mom? he's what just gonna hand you, he's just gonna hand you an outfit. Aww. A very expensive, top of the line couture outfit. Oh, okay. sweet. Who hands you that? That was Jack's gift to, uh, Tanya. Oh. Um, okay, so that's gonna wrap it up. Here's how this works. Oh, wait, is it like a business suit or an evening gown? They're, they're supposed to be very, very high, high-end casual wear. Uh, so okay, so at the end of this story, there are 16 XP total. Damn. I'm, I'm sorry, no, those, that's not 16. Whoa, hold on, that's way off. That's, <laughs> that is, say. that is 16... 16 supernatural beats oh, at three beats to an XP that works five. out to five supernatural XP. That's pretty good. Um, then a oh, hundred and three beats. Good lord. Equals 34 and a third beats. Uh, so there's 35 beats, we'll call it, or 35 XP. 35 divided by four is still gonna be like eight something a piece. 35, uh... Plus some yeah. leftover for... Do you round uh, up or down? I'm gonna go and say... I'm gonna go round the whole thing up. I'm not gonna leave stuff left over in the pot today. Then, yeah, so I was gonna say, do you... Are you gonna... For, everybody's you gonna, gonna get, like, everybody's gonna get one... Every, everybody is going to get one supernatural experience point. Okay. And you know what? That's that's not... I, I'm not giving, enough, giving that enough supernatural XP. We're gonna call it two supernatural XP. 
Well, I mean, it's not like we have all that much experience with our Is powers. Is that AXP on my sheet? AXP, yeah. It, the A okay. stands for Arcane. Yeah, it's like the Sunday game. Just ignore that part. Well, see, mine is, it actually is marked as SXP. Um, and then you will get That's nine nice. experience points. That Yay. is a fuckload of XP. What's the I name have of a story, question. By the way? What is the name of this story? This story was The Rich Man's Hope. That's right. Oh, eight. I'm sorry, how much uh, supernatural? Two supernatural Thank experience you. points. Thank Nine you. normal experience points. So, yeah. here's how this works, okay? Uh, for every point of equality you want to purchase, it'll cost you one XP. If you want to buy a specialty, which I what will explain it? in a second. What is equality? Equality Equa quality merits, basically. Oh, okay. So you, you said... Eight regular and two X arcane or supernatural. Eight regular, eight regular, two supernatural. That's what you're getting. I'm oh, basically yeah. converting one of your normal into a uh, yeah supernatural. That's fine. um skills. If you want to buy a dot of a skill, it'll cost you two XP. If you want to buy a dot of an attribute, it'll cost you four XP. If you want to rebuy your integrity and you have role played yourself doing something heroic to justify it, it'll be three points of XP. Okay, wait, wait. R Go back, uh, uh, everything but the integrity real quick. Okay. A specialty, which is like, okay, uh, oh, the way a specialty works is you're going to write it down next to your skill, and mm -hmm. any time your specialty applies, it gives you plus one dice. But it costs, and since it only applies to that one specific circumstance, like let's say firearms, specialty shotguns, you only get the extra dice with shotguns, right? Uh, okay. uh, but the specialties cost half as much. Only one XP instead of two. Uh, yep, because uh, a dot of a skill will cost you two. Uh, a dot of an attribute will cost you four. Yep. Um, let's start. Let's start. Let's start with Tanya. Uh, over the course of this adventure, do you feel that Tanya oh exercised any particular skills? Thank you for the follow, Blazing Defang. Sweet. Yay. Follow hype. Oh, oh man, I totally gotta job. make a paper that says follow hype on you gotta it. You gotta make now. it. Yeah, you gotta. You gotta follow camera that. Because I've got actually so, like. A what, what do you think Tanya everything. would have improved over the course of this adventure? And over the course of the several weeks of downtime that'll be happening after this adventure. I think a cult. Mm -hmm. She's been activating her power an awful lot. Yep. She's been trying to, at least. Yeah. Trying to do stuff with that. I, Dude, I love my character loves the fact that she's got a superpower. She's going to try to use it whenever she can. She fucking yep. loves that shit. I so, wish. So, I yeah. Wish like, mine is just a bonus and I get drunk afterwards. She's just like, I have, I see, I have no downside to this yet. There's going to be one, don't I guarantee you, at some point. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'd say a cult? Levi's jealous. Um, <laughs> Superpowers is another quick game of in trouble. How much do I have to spend? Looks like I have 11. Whoa. I haven't spent any of my XP. Yep. I, gave, I gave you the same XP everybody else got for the start of the first, for the first adventure to keep yeah. you on point. Yeah, I think yeah you should have 12, 12 experience and then 3 supernatural experience. Oh, okay. Yep, 12 and 3. That's what we'll go with. Okay. Oh, I, got, I got 3 uh, for the first one. I've got one. an extra. I've got, well, yeah, 3 and 8 is 11, though. No, yeah. we got 9 for this one. No, we, got, we got 8. I, con I, I converted one of the 9 mundane that you got this time yeah. to an arcane okay. because I was not, because uh, it was lopsided no, and I didn't like the yeah, way it landed. Okay, so we got 8. Yep, okay. you get 8. So, so, you get, so you get 3 and 11. I have a question, Grant. How much does it cost to upgrade a supernatural thing? Okay. If uh, That depends. Um, do you like want to acquire extra? a new power or increase your power trait? What if I wanted to increase my... Uh, or get a new power? To get a new power? It depends on the power that you wind up getting. Um, now that, like, so you laugh about it because your character doesn't know, right, those powers. But uh, the way that I'm going to rule this is, like, you, you guys will develop new powers. And you won't be able to control those powers until you buy them. Um, right. Meanwhile, there is also, like, I don't know if you've noticed if you guys have figured this out yet or not, but magic is real. It is possible for you guys to pick up and learn spells. When you do, whatever the spell does, I'll tell you how many dots it costs. It counts as a merit, a quality, a spell that you know. Yeah, how do we figure that out? Uh, well, the only people that have shown you how to do any magic at all are the leaflings. That's true. They taught us a walk between the world spell. Yes. For which you and need a leaf. For, yes. Which I you need have a leaf, one. a prayer, and a dance. 
I have one. Jack no. has a leaf. Okay, wait. So, <laughs> do we have to witness a power like that in order for us to know that it's a power that we can buy, or is your character it, has to or... find some way to know that it exists? Okay, like, you would so need some kind of mental go, figure or something. We can't just go. I want this random power. Right. No. 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 It. It. it that. Or that is the kind of stuff go, that you. I want a power, so I'm gonna pay the XP for that, and then you give us a random power. Right. No. no. Uh, it, basically, what happens is in each story, every now and then, I'm gonna try as part of the campaign to introduce new powers, and once you've seen yourself enact a power, you'll be able to buy it. And until you buy it with the XP, you won't be able to actively call on it when you want. Okay. Right. Okay. 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 Um, so how much does the walking between worlds? Cost? Walking between worlds is gonna cost you. Oh, what is that? Uh, the Spirit Three to normally. step across the gauntlet, or or normal, Death Three yeah. to step into Twilight. Yeah. Yeah, we'll call it. So it'll be a it'll be a four dot merit. So it'll be four XP. Four XP. Regular or just our, or just supernatural. Uh, for that because you're actually spending mundane efforts and time to do it, you can you can purchase both. Uh, spend both on that if you want. Uh, uh, tempted. Or you can, can save. Can can you bring others? So, Tanya, if you want to purchase your dot of occult, all right, you can spend two I'm experience points. I'm debating a dot of brawl. I, uh, the past couple Avengers, I've been... I know, I've right? Me brawls. too. I'm I'm, been, I know, I've been thinking animal can, composure, and brawl. He, was, he got a rat. He wants to get, he wants to start learning how to talk to it. He oh, does. Is for a skill oh again? my god, he wants a regular to skill. Hulk wants Two points for a regular skill, and you gotta tell me what skill it is so we can work out whether or yeah. not the character should actually have picked it up. Um, um for now, I would yep. like to say occult and brawl for Those me. Those are both entirely justified. So you can spend yeah. four XP and get one dot on each. So far, yeah. Uh, note each purchase separately with the time and the date. Or not the time, just the date. XP cool. spent, yeah. Yep. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna take a point of brawl, a point of animal can, and a point of composure. Okay. Because I actually have the XP to pay for all of those, and those are the things I've definitely been thinking, like, that, that would be good yep. to have. Composure for the Hulk is a great stat. There's that, and there's the fact that, yeah, that's, there's basically just that. <laughs> yep, there's basically just that. Uh, it also gives me okay. another point of willpower. Optical, what do you got for me? Um, I'm definitely going to pick up a point of stealth. Yep. <laughs> and... Um... I want to pick up a point of resolve. Okay. that Both of those just... are fine. Uh, resolve is going to cost you four. Stealth is going to cost you two. Okay. Uh, let's, let's, let's skip the resolve for right now. Um, uh, let's do... Hmm. Stealth. Um, oh, fuck. Subterfuge. Stealth and subterfuge. Yeah. No, that's solid. Good stuff okay. for Jack. Good stuff for Jack. All right. So, what we're going to do here, right? Check this out. I got these fancy screens I get to use this time. Ready? Boom. Oh, my God. Thank you for the follow. The Hood 753. I am Evil Squeegee, as you can see right there. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, I stream every single morning, 8 o'clock in the morning. EST, I play Final Fantasy XIV. You can catch this show. This is Darkness Rising. You can catch this show every Saturday at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. EST every Saturday. Normally we have one more guy with us, Pith. We're gonna start our next adventure, and you guys want You guys want a fucking sneak preview of what's coming up? Check this out. Ready? Check this out. Sneak, goddamn oh God. preview. All oh right. Oh God, no. All right. I don't understand. What is with this truck? Look Check. at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this. This, this is what's coming up next week. This All right. city looks trashed. Axel's gonna be so pissed. He's got a lot of cleaning for those streets. All right, that's it's like the antithesis of everything he stands for. That's what's happening next week, guys. All right, so so don't miss that. And we also play uh, Dungeons and Dragons at nine o'clock in the morning on Friday mornings here. All right, it makes so me then, so uh... happy to see Cassie. All right, so Pluto Fairy. Oh God, man, I don't stream anymore. My internet busted. Take this camera <laughs> off me. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> hey, join the club. It's okay. I know, right? I no, in all honesty, I um, I usually do stream Final Fantasy fourteen um in the mornings from ten a.m. Eastern Standard to one p.m. Eastern Standard. However, my internet, because I pay fucking time wanker cable for shit, is um, I'm not, I haven't been streaming lately. But hopefully, hopefully at the end of this month, um, by the end of August, I should be good. But until then, you can catch me here because my computer can handle my internet can handle this. Or I'm usually hanging out one of these fucker streams. It's right. True. 
evil squeegee or optical. Pith. Pith usually, too. Hang out in my stream sometimes. You don't. Ha! <laughs> Shut up. You know what, Matt? Since you volunteered, why don't you, uh, why don't you do your shout-out now, Matt? Take it away. I am MRM Dubois. You can find me at Twitter at MRM Dubois. And uh, I will tweet random shit about what I think about what we're doing here and, uh, you know, any plot threads or whatever that I think might be going on. So if you want to, you know, do the conspiracy theory shit with me, awesome. I'll also retweet random stuff that I find online that I think is cool. So, hey, I actually get a shout out now. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Optical, you're up. Hey. Hey, DJ. Anyway, I had to do hey. that. Hey! <laughs> um, I'm Optical. Uh, obviously, OBT1KO. Uh, you can catch me on Twitter at Optical. Uh, you can catch me here on Twitch at Optical. You can catch me... Wow, I just saw my thing and holy Yeah, you look shit. like comic book, dude. That looks sick. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> um... Uh, YouTube, we're just starting to get things worked out on YouTube, so don't go there right now. <laughs> <laughs> not yet, not yet. Uh, but we do have some big things right now. We're still doing uh, we're doing our second modded playthrough of Fallout Three and New Vegas at the same time. It's completely modded playthrough. It is fantastic, and we're doing all the DLCs completely blind. I haven't done any of the DLCs, and we're having a blast with it. Um, you can catch me on Twitch. Uh, Monday through Thursday, noon to 5 p.m., and Fridays at 12.30 to 5 p.m., Saturdays from noon to 3 p.m., and Sundays from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., all Eastern Standard Times. And, yeah. All Woo! right. All right. Uh, thanks for hanging out, guys. Yeah. We'll be back next week. We'll be back next week with uh, with the adventure simply titled Alicia. All right, so don't miss it. All right, we'll be back. Bye, Felicia. We're back in one week, guys. <laughs> Enjoy the awesome. credits. Yes.